Hello, welcome to this new video. This is where I launch this rocket into the moon. Or at the moon. Yeah. Here we are trying to land this on a moon to make a moon base. Which take 34 minutes. I've decided to start making these videos. Or I don't know. Today. No. It looks it looks to appear that I overshot it. And here I am landing it. Mm. So just to be clear, I won't use any cheats except heat damage for obvious reasons. And the only time I'll ever put on other cheese is only infinite fuel, nothing else. And when I do put on infinite fuel, that will be extremely rarely and I'll only use it just to do one thing, and that's it. Also, while recording this video, I had to redo this whole video because I'm using this on CapCut, and I used my phone vertically, not horizontally, which did not make it look good, nor would it fit in YouTube format. I also have this big tower right next to those habitational modules or that thing right next to that big tower just so that I know where I'm supposed to land and also to make and also I did that before I even started recording and I did not feel like doing it again because I did this video twice <laughs> I've also recorded this part accidentally vertically I think it looked good so I did not want to like Start quote unquote recreating it. So, mm. here I started like reusing some um, blueprints from like other builds to make this um refueling station for my drones to like air stuff as they require fuel. And if you're even watching this. Oh, but oh yeah, a good one. As this is gonna be seven minutes worth of content. Three, two, one, lift off. I just decided to just make that just so I don't feel like something is up. Just the music. You'll hear that more frequently. Depends on how it goes. Here I started running out of fuel, and here you'll soon start seeing me put on infinite fuel. As I said, I only put this on uh, extreme cases. I guess you see her up there. Yeah. It's only for extreme cases, just to like connect to that gateway so that I can like refuel this thing. And as you can see, I turned it off. As you can see, but I, did, but I decided to use some fuel for like the drones part so as you can see here i'm starting to connect and yeah as you can see here i'm starting to land and i kind of overshot it so i'll fix that up and yeah As you can see, there the base is like nothing, but you can still see that tower big thing. These for communications, so like hopefully when the astronaut update comes out or something like that, then they'll all be like... It will be fair to say that the crash count will be probably high at the end of this series, but hey, who here will know? Place your bets. Here is where the drones come useful as I need it to move stuff to where they need to be to make this base actually functional or, or able to make it look good.
here I actually use a genius way to use it instead of just like all moving it up and do it and use it all to like do something instead I'll just stack it up and just move it all at once and then I don't want to like use the fuel and yeah that's the end of Star Trek episode 1 see ya